shareholder activists have been around for a long time, but they were different in the 80s. In the 80s, it was more uh, people like Ivan Bosky or Asher Edelman who were into your stock. They knew a specific goal to get the company sold, and then they were gone. Right? The you know, activism, for want of a better word, is a much broader universe. You know, there are a lot of hedge funds. There are a lot of uh, event-driven funds, and you know, institutional clients are very interested in good corporate governance and the like. I think it's been it's much harder now uh, for companies than it was ten years ago. You know, the uh, investors have gotten a lot more challenging to to management teams. And I think on balance, that's good. I mean, management should be challenged. The bad part of activism is that it's, it's so short-term focused that it forced people to do irrational things, which was buying back stock at the absolute worst time. And that's what happened in the last couple of years. The activists would go in and say, look, all these banks are there willing to lend you money and lever your company up six, seven, eight times cash flow with no covenants. How could you not take this very low interest money and lever up and you know, give the capital back to shareholders? And while that has a lot of you know, appeal, at least when you basically do the math, the reality is they don't have to live with it. And my advice has always been to companies that you need to do what's right for your capital structure for the long term. You, know, you can point to deals where activists got in there uh, and it didn't turn out well. Um, and they should have taken deals that they didn't take, right? So, you know, for example, in Lear Seating, was, could have done an LBO at a uh, very high price, and some very activist shareholders said no. Or I think Gabelli regrets to this day that he didn't do the deal for Cablevision. So there is just, an, I think, the, it's not unhealthy, it's healthy, but uh, there are so, it's, it's much more difficult for, for management teams now.